The question is, the ratio of cost price to mark price of an article is 4 is to 5. If the ratio of profit percentage on selling the article to the discount allowed on it is 5 is to 4, what is the profit percentage? Cap Gemini question. So is 5 is to 4, what is the profit percentage? It's a Cap Gemini question. And this question has been asked by one of the members in the group, Aptitude Free Class. Aptitude Free Class Group. Group in Facebook. So I've got a group, Aptitude Free Class Group in Facebook. You can post questions there. I'll be trying to give the video at the earliest. I'll be trying to give you at the earliest. Probably I'll give the answer initially and whenever time permits, I'll give the video. So anybody can become a member there. It's a free of cost. Similarly, this as you are seeing your YouTube, this is also free of cost. Now what happens is, here it is talking now it's a quantity applied question. It's a quantity applied question on cost price, selling price. Also some amount of percentage is involved. Cost, you will have to know the concept of cost price, selling price, mark price. Then the percentages will have to be worked out. So whenever I talk about cost price, cost price will always be equal to, selling price will always be equal to cost price plus profit. Selling price will always be equal to cost price plus profit. By default, if I say make a profit of 10%, it is always on cost. It is always on cost. Nothing is mentioned, it is always on cost. Similarly, when I talk about mark price, mark price is a sticker price. Selling price is the amount I get when I sell the article. The amount I get when I sell the article is the selling price. Amount I pay for a purchasing article is the cost price. Don't get confused with the mark price. Mark price is a manipulating price or a sticker price. So all your New Year discounts are given or Diwali discount, order it is. It is always on the mark price and not on the cost price or the selling price. Selling price is the amount I get. Cost price is the amount I pay. All the others are manipulating prices. So the mark price mentioned here is nothing but the manipulating price. So the mark price minus discount. So selling price will be cost price plus profit. And the mark price, MP is nothing but the mark price. Mark price minus discount will be your selling price. Minus discount will be equal to selling price. Mark the price minus discount will be selling price. You will have to understand this first. Selling price will be the cost price plus profit. Mark price minus discount will be equal to selling price. On this I make a profit. Now what is the cost price and mark price and ratio of 4 is to 5? It's a cost price, cost and mark. This is 4 is to 5. So I can write as whenever it is a ratio problem, whenever the ratio is given as 4 is to 5, I can mark it multiply by the same number. Ratio always be maintained. This is 4, this will be 5. If this is 8, this will be 10. If this is 12, this will be 15 like this. Multiply it by 2, multiply it by this also by 2. Multiply this by 3, multiply this by 3. So I'll make it as 4x and 5x. I'll make it as 4x and 5x. Now they are talking about percentage of profit and discounts. Now, let y be the discount on mark price. Let y be the discount on mark price. Y is the discount on mark price. Discount on mark price. Discount on mark price is y percentage is y percentage this code on mark price is y percentage so the value what will happen is the value will become the value will be y by 100 of 5x discount value so discount percentage is something different discount value is something different discount value will be y by 100 of 5x because it is y percentage it will be y by 100 of 5x will be equal to 5xy. So discount value is 5xy. Discount value will be 5xy. Then what happens is here it is saying a profit percentage on selling article. So something is getting added here. Something is getting added here. So I'll make it as P. I'll convert in terms of because they say the profit percentage to discount percentage is 5 is to 4. So what happens is P will P by Y, profit is P, I will make this profit as P, I am not going to work it out now. Now P I will convert in terms of Y. So P by Y will be equal to 5 by 4. Because they say the profit percentage ratio on selling the article discount allowed on it is 5 is to 4 means profit divided by Y or profit percentage minus Y will be 5 by 4. 
So profit will be equal to profit percentage will be 5 by 4 of 5. Now I'll calculate 5 by 4 of y percentage on 4x. I'll calculate 5 by 4 of y percentage on 4x. So the profit value, profit value, profit value will be 5 by 4 of y divided by 5 by 4 of y divided by 100 into 4x. Now this 4 will get cancelled. This will be equal to so this is 5x y by 100, 5x y by 100, this will also be equal to 5x y by 100. Now when you see here, both the discount values and profit values will be equal. Both the discount values and profit values will be equal. The discount value is 5x by 100, profit value is 5x by 100. The discount values and profit value will be equal. The discount value and profit value will be equal. So I'll make this as some variable. You can write because the both these are equal. Both these are equal. I'll make it as some a. I'll make it as a because this will be equal to a. This will be equal to a. Now when I'm going to give a discount, your selling price is mark price minus discount. So 5x minus a will be equal to say cost price. Cost price is 4x plus a. Now x will be equal to 2a x will be equal to 2a or a will be equal to x by 2 or 0.5x a will be equal to 0.5x now what they ask is profit percentage what they ask is what is the profit percentage see 0.5x is the profit value because this is the discount value this is the discount profit value so a is nothing but the profit value or the discount value 0.5x is the profit value. Profit percentage will be profit divided by cost into 100. Profit percentage is profit divided by cost into 100. Profit divided by cost into 100 is the profit percentage. Profit divided by cost into 100 is the profit percentage. So 0.5x divided by 4x into 100. So this x will get cancelled out will be 50 by 4 which will be equal to 12.5 percent. The answer is 12.5 percent. The answer is 12.5 percent. As simple as this. So first is understanding how to equate it. Unless you are able to do this, this is as equal and then we we'll equate it like this. Selling price in both sides will be equal. Equate it will get x as 0.5x. So 0.5x divided by 4x in 100 will be 50 by 4 which will be 12.5 percent. You can also assign values, take this as 100, this as uh, 80. Because this percentage volume, you can take this as 100, this as 80. And then because it is 5yx, you can make it as what will be 5xy like that. Then equate it because this is equal, it will be 10 and 10. Once I understand this, it will be 10 and 10. So 10 by 40 or 80 into 100 will be 12.5 percent. Subscribe to my channel. I will be adding questions every now and then. You can also subscribe to my website practice aptitude questions there. Wish you all the best.